Hi guys! So recently in my July wrap-up I mentioned that I'm going to be doing a fundraiser through my channel for charity and I kind of briefly talked about it and I thought it would be a good idea to sit down and dedicate an entire video towards information about the fundraiser and the charity. I'm likely going to be referencing this fundraiser in my future videos so I figured it would be a good idea to have this video to reference so that when I talk about it you guys can come here to get more information about it. I know that when people do fundraisers and when people are being asked to donate money towards a certain cause, it's good to know as much about that cause or the organization as possible. So I wanted to let you guys know about the name of the charity. It's called Save the Children and I wanted to give you some basic information about it in case you're a little hesitant or unsure or you're just wanting to know more information. So I want to read the message that they kind of have as their general idea for the purpose of their organization and it says, Save the Children believes every child deserves a future and in the US and around the world we give a healthy start in life, the opportunity to learn, and protection from harm. We do whatever it takes for children every day and in times of crisis, transforming their lives and the future we share. When they say around the world, they really are involved in a lot of different countries. On their website, it says they're involved with 120 different countries. And because this is a very big, important thing that a lot of people want to know about organizations, it says that 86.5% of all the money that they earn goes towards their programs. Part of the reason that I chose this organization for this first fundraiser type thing I'm doing through my channel is because of the fact that it does help in so many different countries and I figure YouTube and booktube and everything like that is something that is accessible throughout the entire world. A lot of you are watching me from totally different countries, you're way across different oceans and everything so I figured if you're really passionate about helping in your own country, in your home, then this is an organization that you can feel good about because you can know it's not only helping people around the world but in people right around where you live. Another reason that I chose this specific organization is because of what they can do with the money they make. They specify on their website if you make this much money or raise this much money this is what it can help go towards and you're gonna see when I read them off why that would pertain to my channel or all of us who are interested in reading but I'll start at the beginning it says if you raise $200 it helps provide ready-to-use food to help save malnourished children $300 raised can help provide healthcare essentials to a school clinic serving hundreds of children and $500 raised can provide a bookcase full of children's books to help ch children learn to read. There are of course so many wonderful organizations and charities out there that I would love, love, love to help raise money for but I chose this one to do first because I plan on doing more of these types of things in the future but I chose this one first because a lot of us have come together and had fun talking about books and we're passionate about reading and about books and when I saw that $500 raised can provide a bookcase full of children's books for helping children learn to read I just thought this is something that already a lot of us are passionate about so it would make sense if that was the kind of thing that we came together to try and help raise money for. Now getting to the part that's always kind of a bit awkward and that is of course asking for other people's help. I would so love to contact so many of you because I'm sure a lot of you have a big heart for this kind of stuff as well. But I said in my July wrap up that I know it can make people so incredibly uncomfortable to ask them to help raise money for something or to ask them in general if they care about like starving children or things like that because of course everybody cares but not everybody has the time and the money or the resources or the energy to dedicate to doing it right now. So I wanted to kind of give you guys some ideas for if I'm asking for your help what that might entail in case you are interested in helping out with this. For starters, for those of you that have no social media presence whatsoever, I of course am going to be mentioning people that do, but if you don't, you can still help as well. I am thinking about having ways to just raise awareness about this cause, because of course the more money we can raise, the better. So even something as simple as helping me come up with a hashtag to share on Twitter and things like that, or helping me make pretty pictures to share on Instagram or on Facebook or things like that just to get people to see that this is going on. Anything as simple as that would be really helpful. For those of you that do have your own social media presence, whether it be a bookstagram, booktube channel, a blog, 
or maybe something not related to books at all, but you still really would love to use your platform to raise awareness about this, I would love your guys' help. Like I mentioned with Instagram or Twitter, things like that, I can only manage to even try to answer all your guys' responses to my videos and stuff like that. And the idea of having to do all this all by myself, I just know I wouldn't be able to do it as well as I would if there were a few other people willing to maybe monitor things on Twitter or try to share pictures on Instagram and Facebook or all sorts of other things that I don't do. For instance, there's like Tumblr and stuff that I just have no idea what I would be doing. So anybody who would like to use their platform to help raise awareness about this, I would absolutely love your guys' help as well. I'm also thinking about doing some kind of tag video or tag on Instagram or things like that that people can do. And that's just something you can do without even having to donate money. You could do some kind of a tag video that we come up with just to say, hey, I'm answering these questions and I'm doing this to try and help raise awareness for this charity or something like that. So it really doesn't have to be a ton, just a simple sharing a picture or helping me come up with an idea or something like that. Anything you guys can think of. And if you guys have other ideas or have done fundraisers in the past and you completely know what you're doing, please let me know that in the comments section down below. I would so appreciate suggestions or comments or questions or anything like that. Anyway, without getting all sappy and cheesy on you guys, I just find for me personally that I try really hard to live my life by the idea that be the change that you want to see in the world. And even though it's not like I have a huge following or anything like that, you don't have to be super rich or super famous or anything like that to make a difference. You can make a difference on a small scale and that's what I'm trying to do. So if you guys would like to help with this, please let me know in the comment section down below. And like I said, if you have ideas or suggestions or anything like that, let me know that as well because I think, I think <laughs> that the $500 that would buy a bookcase full of children's books for helping kids learn to read. I think that that is a completely doable goal if we work together and try really hard to raise awareness about this. One final thing, if you guys have organizations that you absolutely love, leave those in the comments section down below also because like I said earlier, I would love to do more things like this as my channel grows and continue to just help people in the world or help animals or children or education or anything, whatever the cause is, if you guys know of some great charities that you love, let me know that in the comment section down below. Anyway, that's it for today. I know there's a few of you who have already let me know that you'd be interested in helping out and I will message you guys sometime this week. But anyway, I'm not gonna do my usual spiel of telling you guys to like and stuff like that because it just feels inappropriate, but I will, I'm just so excited to, to be doing this and to get to talk to you guys about this, so. Have a good week. I will see you soon. Bye.